breaking news, and the Tri-State's most accurate forecast. This is 9 on your side. Last caught on camera, a calm day for some workers turns into chaos. You are seeing this video for the first time right now on 9 on your side at 5. Surveillance video capturing the exact moments of a grain elevator explosion just before noon today. Amazingly, no one was hurt. It was amazing, and new information coming to us from the scene in Evendale for the first time today, a possible cause. The business owned by Bungie Limited is located on East Sharon Road. Nine on your side's Jason Law has more on that video and what may have caused this blast. Jason. Well, this is the grain elevator right now here live at 5 o'clock. It's still intact. In fact, firefighters are still trying to put the fires out inside. Investigators just told us literally minutes ago that they now suspect a dust explosion, which happens when a bunch of particles are together. They energize and become combustible, and it can cause this. Something inside this silo set off a chain reaction of explosions, one after the other. A large fireball erupts from the right side. The force blows out the windows. The video you're seeing was recorded by surveillance cameras from a nearby company, Taylor Logistics. And it shook the building a little bit. We heard this explosion. It was kind of weird. Carrie didn't want us to show her face. She works at Taylor and knows the silo well. She stares at it every day through her office window. For precautionary measures, they want us to go ahead and leave for the day. And you can see there's significant damage. Most of the windows are gone and most of the doors have been blown out, which they're supposed to do. Firefighters were very concerned about the possibility of a secondary explosion. Extremely dangerous. Uh, dust, residual dust explosions. Uh, that's why we have so many units on scene. Uh, for us to enter the structure is extremely dangerous at this time. And as we mentioned, the grain elevator is owned by a company called Bungie North America, part of Bungie Limited. Firefighters, again, still on the scene, and those secondary explosions are still an issue, although less of a concern a few hours after this explosion. They say the fire is simply at this point still too hot to try and tackle from the inside. We're live in Evendale. Jason Law, nine on your side. Jason, thank you. The I-Team's chief...